guys, what is good? Welcome back to the show with Speakers Lab. The gang is back. You guys know what it is. Look, man, my name is Beaker. We got Melly over there too, because we're back here for the original Basil Max. That's right, guys. We're over here on Beaker's Lab, the Town Hall 13 base. We've been over here a lot more lately because we're trying to figure out what we're going to do over here. We might even rush to the next town hall. Before any of that happens, we put uh, we, we had one more thing that we wanted to do, and we put it to a vote to you guys. You guys decided what the next thing we were going to do, possibly the final thing we're going to do in this base. And I got some good news and some bad news. The votes are in, but I haven't seen them yet. <laughs> So guys, get your shades on, get your shoes off. I'm assuming if I had, I know you guys, I'm assuming you chose the most expensive one. I'm sure like two of you chose the cheapest option. You're like, hey, Beak's, Beak's gonna need some help in this one. And then the other 99% of you were like, yup, that's the most expensive one. Let's do that. Anyway, guys, we can't wait any longer. Let's go see what you chose because days till max resumes in three, two, one. All right, guys, before we get started, let's get a cookie from Melly. You guys want to give it to him? Okay, grab on. All right. Come here, Mel. What? Wait, so we can't see the... What? Dude, I'm, I'm serious. The YouTube app on iPads is bizarre. Why would... Okay, hang on. Oh, guys, there it is. I just sent the screenshot from my phone. There it is. 60,000 votes, half of which were for the Expos. Yay! So basically 30,000 people were like, we should do the Expos, the most expensive one in the game. And by the way, if you guys aren't familiar with this, we need to do all of them at once. There's no, there's no other way to do it. All right, guys, and this doesn't make any sense, but in the poll below that, you chose which hero pet we're gonna upgrade on our other base. You chose the Pekka Dog, which is the cheapest one. So I don't know whether like you guys are just your chaos. That's all I can say. Let's go. All right, guys. So if we're going to do four Expos today, what's the damage on that? Okay. So at best, at best, it's going to be 68 million, right? Did I do that math right? Yeah, I think so. It's crazy. How are we going to get that? Well, there is some good news, guys. I saw up here, there was something in the shop. Uh... Guys, I can't believe this is here. Usually when you need a rune of gold, there's no rune of gold to be found. So we got that one. We have a full storage already and we have one in the gold pass. If we absolutely need it, we're going to need it. We're going to probably need it. It is right there. Can you imagine if I just sold it accidentally? But before any of this happens, guys, we got to go into something called raids before upgrades. Let's start round one. Uh, guys, what's going on here? What am I looking at here? Okay, so the town hall is outside. It's upgrading and it's outside. All the scattershot... This is perfect because I don't know if you guys have noticed, but we have a dumb army. I think I'm just... I think I have a problem right now with skeleton spells. I don't know why we did it all day yesterday. We did it all day the day before that. Do we have another siege? No. <laughs> okay, let's go. Come on, guys. Go up to the town hall. That's a wrap. That's it. They're done. I mean, they're going to go down, right? Oh, wait a minute. I don't know if they're going to get it or not. Is this going to be perfect? It's going to be perfect. Yeah. All right, guys. So next step, we're going to get that down. We're going to get that down and a P.E.K.K.A. Because we don't have a queen walk, but we do have, you know, I mean, we can bust through the walls here. It's not going to be too bad. And I think the best part about this is going to be the skeletons. So we can get them down anywhere we want. We can get this over here because, again, we don't have any wall breakers, but that'll help. Okay. Other P.E.K.K.A.s. Get you down. Get you down. Get that down. Let's get a rage right there. And let's start to go in. Here we go. Oh no! Oh no! What are we doing here with this with the balloons? Okay, that's gonna be bad. I'm gonna keep the skeletons down, but uh those balloons are gonna be bad. So far, so good, I guess. Dude, so many peckers, but they're all on the side over there. That's not great. Okay, let me hit that. Dude, I'm so proud of the super archers for actually getting through those those uh clan castle troops. That was good. So up here, guys, we we're gonna need the warden ability because we're going up against that. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. 
Perfect timing, perfect timing. This stresses me out. I think that's why I like using the skeleton spell army because it is like, you will fail at any point if you don't keep dropping the skeletons. And plus you gotta find an easy base. Maybe not super easy, but you can't go up against something real hard. Yeah. Anyway, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to get that other scatter shot. Maybe it'll be okay. Dang, dude, scatter shots are so unforgiving. It is, it is brutal. Anyway, this is a pretty fun way to start the day. We actually got a bit of loot and uh, we didn't even need much gold. So perfect. But I think we got a good amount of dark on this and we got a good amount of elixir. Cool. There it is. Wait, what? I, I swear when I saw this base, guys, I swear when I saw this base, I thought the loot said something different. I thought it said there was a bunch of elixir. Okay, okay. All right, guys, we got time for one more raid before we go back to base and spend a ton of gold for the main event. But I was just gonna say to you guys, and I think this is it. I need some Dark Elixir. This is it. Plus, this army is so expensive. This this army probably costs as much as that. Uh, it probably costs 7,000 Dark Elixir. Yeah, let's go. Okay, so step number one, get the enemy queen. Dude, I got no idea what this army is. No idea. All right, here we go. Uh, do we have wall breakers? We have no wall breakers. What am I doing? Uh... <laughs> I guess I'm just gonna let a troop bust open the wall. I, I don't know why I didn't bring any wall breakers. Okay, well, on that note, we'll do the same thing over here. This is gonna be very weird. Very, very weird. And over here, I wish I had... I wish I had a skeleton spell because that is going to be a problem. Anyway, we'll figure it out. Here we go. Okay, we're going to get right into it, guys. Let's get the siege down. Don't knock me down yet. Don't knock me down yet. Okay, so we got these super archers. What am I gonna do with them? I guess I'll drop them with the queen. I, I seriously don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Here we go. I'll go gang. Here we go. Okay, if they go to the outside, that's gonna be a problem in the in the, in the beginning, but I think we can eventually get over to the town hall. Uh, let's get a heal there because we're getting wrecked. Okay, come on guys. Come on, get back up. Get back on the, oh no. What, what's happening? Okay, that should take down the town hall. We're good. Is there anybody left down here? Oh no. What an absolute mess. And I, I don't care. I love it every time. Every time we do a bunch of hog riders, I have so much fun. And this one would have been better if we focused on the hog riders more. For some reason, we had this idea to bring like, I don't know, a bunch of super archer. No, no. You just killed my super archer and I don't think there's anything you could have done right there to make me more sad. This was stressful. It was fun. It was stressful. Well guys, no matter what, take a second to catch your breath because it is now time to go back to base for the main event. All right, guys, welcome back to the main event, a show within a show where we do something stupid. I'm your host, Beaker. We got my co-host, Sleepy Melly over there. Guys, we got to do every one of these expos today, and I'm tempted to do them at full price. So guys, if we get the discounts from the gold pass, it's not really going to make a difference. Basically, when we hit a gold rune, we're going to be doing these with gold runes, right? When we hit a gold rune, it gets a full storage, and that's essentially what this is. So even if it's, you know, 16 million, it doesn't really matter. We still got to hit a gold rune either way. I don't know if that made sense, but it made sense to me. Okay, cool. Hey guys, before we get started, I actually do want to go in here and get this. So we have the full elixir, even more dark elixir. Oh, that looks good, dude. That looks good. Okay, let me get a picture of that. All right, guys, here we go. We got a bit of line here and we're going to start the stopwatch in three, two, one. Okay, now if you guys have never done this with us, we try to get it 10 seconds because even if you're boosted, 10 seconds is the ideal time. 
three, two, boom. Gold rune. Done. Okay, now as we're here, let's go in here and get this one. Done. Boom. Okay, uh, now we get this. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. We did it. We did it. Nine. 30. Okay, now we hit the final gold rune. I can't. I can't believe this worked. I can't believe this worked. Okay. Eight, nine, done. <sighs> wow. What an upgrade, right? Like having this much of, I mean, this is like some of the craziest defenses on your base and having them all upgrading at the same time. It's like on our other base right now, we're upgrading all of our, all of our air defense, right? We should go check that out tomorrow and see what it's like to have no air defense because you know, we're getting just destroyed. You, and this is going to be the same way. We're going to be destroyed. I mean, we already are. Dude, look at that one right there. Somebody used bats with, why? I guess to clear out the defenses. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. That's weird though. I've never seen that. It's like super expensive farming, but you know, to each their own, it's cool. Melly, what? Dude, you guys can't see him now. Well, his head is blocked a little bit, but he's just eating hay and also sleeping or, you know, resting. What a, what a boss. Anyway, guys, like we said, that's it for today. We will see you right here tomorrow on the One Alien Beakers Lab. By the way, thank you for picking the most expensive one. I mean, it, maybe there was more expensive ones, but this one felt... <laughs> this one felt pretty expensive. Guys, we'll see you right here tomorrow on the One and Only Beakers Lab. Peace.